promised you guys a little bit of barn stuff. So here's what I have so far. I'm building a five bent two story timber frame barn. So there's going to be four bays. Um, the tie beams that you see running across the top with the joist notches cut, those are 10 by 16 timbers. And that bent right there is 28 feet wide. You can see where my top plates are going to be going on to that tenon, that tongue sticking up there in that beam. Um, I've got my sawmill right there. Now uh, these, this stuff was all uh, all logs when I got it. Everything here I milled. And I uh, get pine logs from a logger because unfortunately I don't have any on my property, which would be nice. These right here, are five by eights. Uh, they're about 12 feet long. Those are my floor joists for the second floor. Um, as you can see, I have plenty of work to do yet, but it's getting along. i got to make my hardwood wedges for the scarfs. I've got pretty substantial timber locks, a whole lot of them holding all that together. Um, so it's, it's coming along. I've got to get back to it. Um, you can see everything's a mess around here with all the projects, but... Once this barns up a lot of this stuff right here, all this junk will be cleaned up. Um, but there's some of the beams waiting to go up. Uncovered because hopefully I'll be putting them up soon. There's a, oh, a set and a half of tie beams there ready to go. A couple wall post beams. A lot of siding boards, flooring boards. Um, can see I picked through my piles a lot. If this was summertime I would not be able to get away with that. They would be warped so bad and everything else. Uh, nice thing about having a sawmill is you have uh, ready split firewood at your disposal if you have milled a lot of logs. Um, I've got to set the sawmill back up. It was set up in here right along this uh, back wall here. So, on these two ends, that opening's about 15 and a half feet wide right there. There's going to be uh, a door. It is 10 feet to the bottom of the tie beam. So there'll be a big sliding door on this end. There's going to be a big sliding door in the front. Um, that's the swing sets that I like to play on, you know, uh, when I get bored with this. So I'll just go swing for a little while. You know, I'm like a two-year-old. Um, I don't know how easy that is to see, but I've got some flooring up already. It's coming along. Tie beams fit in those notches. Or the, excuse me, the floor joists fit right in the joist notches. The wall plates over here. Let me get a better view here. Trying not to show all my messes, but what are you going to do? So, there's the housings for my, uh, for my wall plates. And those are uh, those guys right here. So when I go to stand a bet up, I have to take a two by four and I use it kind of like a post and screw all these wall plates to it when they're tied in the other end. And that holds them in place where, I, where I've got to, when I go to knock these, uh, the next section into it. Um, doing all this alone. This is, uh, it's been a good time. I was, I was carrying these floor joists up a 10 foot step ladder on my shoulder and that wasn't working out too good. Uh, they're anywhere from 120 to 170 pounds a piece. There's some hemlock mixed in with a pine. So wrestling those up a 10 foot ladder by yourself, trying to position them in, I don't feel like breaking my back. The, uh, next bet I lift hopefully be soon, I will uh, show you guys how I'm doing that alone. I made a uh, frame for my tractor on the front end loader, took the bucket off, made a frame, and I'm actually able to pick those right up. So there will be plenty more to follow. I'm going to be, I've uh, got some joinery to cut soon. I'll film that and we'll uh, see what we can do. But all that back there, it's all firewood. And it's pine. I don't particularly love burning pine, but it's free firewood. 
just put it in the stove good and dry otherwise you're gonna creosote up pretty bad so for those of you wondering what that is it's a little coal forge I built now I use it to heat wax to seal in grains up um, but <clears throat> there it is so far